Hello, today I want to talk to you a little bit about a fun little project I have. Um, I have just made up these little collectible cards uh, that contain a vial. There's a little vial uh, attached to a card. One carat of Palado Gem Rough. These are the little gemstones that have not been fasted yet. Um, practically because they're just too small to fasten. And so it's kind of a byproduct of our um, alpha meteorite. And if you've seen our pilot, uh, you know a little bit about uh, the, the alpha stone. And uh, we, in, in that particular meteorite, we need to melt down uh, the meteorite to extract these crystals that are uh, really valued, valuable gemstones. And so the company that uh, I put together along with some investors of mine that we, we worked on this project even before the TV show was even in anyone's mind. Uh, we've been working at this site and uh, recovering meteorites. And in the photo here is, is a photo of uh, Jeff and I during the pilot with one of the specimens that uh, we recovered. And inside it, it has these gemstones. And some of them are facetable. I guess that's the word, uh, into gemstones. And I've got right here, don't know if you can see it, uh, a little gemstone from outer space. Came from one of the meteorites that I found up at our alpha site. And so we've got um, these gemstones and uh, the byproduct of extracting these uh, gemstones out of the meteorite are the real little ones that we can't pass it. So I've put this little uh, collectible together on the back, has a little COA. Um, about it. Of course, if someone's really interested in, in one of the bigger gemstones, um, we've got a lot more information over at the paladot.com website of ours. Um, and I'm actually going to get into covering a little bit more about that because there's quite a bit of questions about it, what these gemstones are and what they're not. Um, but for the people who are not interested in that, but still might want a souvenir from the television show, I've put some of these up uh, up on eBay to test how well they might be uh, they might be able to uh, work and uh, so if you have an interest you can run over there and look at them of course if you're interested in one of the bigger gemstones uh, we'd love to talk to you about that too so i uh, been sitting around for a couple years actually wondering what to do with these little things and uh, so finally found a way to do it. It's kind of a, an amazing thing. The, the meteorite collecting community, there's a bunch of different interests. Some of them want uh, whole stones. Uh, some people want full slices. Some people like end pieces. Some people like $10 little square pieces of as many as they can get. Other people want one square inch piece or others only want the meteorites that fell in the state that they live. Um, someone might want one that was that fell on their birthday. Um, some people collect meteorites, just a certain type of meteorites. Some people uh, like to make thin sections, so they, they examine meteorites underneath a uh, microscope. All different strokes for all different folks. Um, this is is one of these marketing things that is not going to appeal to uh, probably 97% of the collectors out there, but a few of them will, and it's kind of one of these things uh, sometimes you get lemons and you want to try to make lemonade out of it. And, uh, not that this is really lemons, but, uh, it's definitely some pretty nice lemonade. And, uh, anyway, that's about it. Thought I'd share that with you and anyone that's been watching that has an interest in this, go over to, uh, eBay. You can just type in meteorite or meteorite gemstones or whatever. Um, and, uh, I'm sure you can find some of this. Have a good day.